Don't make me drink alone. 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 Hey guys, it's Daria. And we're reviewing Ma. So uh, why don't you go get you a glass and don't make us drink alone. Why have you do this review? D, play our music. This is the most fun I've had in a long time. You know, we gotta make a rule. This rule is Octavia Spencer can't do no more horror movies. She she can't. She can't. She can't do no more while she's the villain. Because this made me uncomfortable. Oh, she was awesome. I was uncomfortable. That was the best Throughout part. this whole damn movie. Yeah. She, girl crazy. And I was so nervous because it was from it was the producers from Get Out, right? Uh, it was it was from the same production company, yeah, Blumhouse. Oh, uh, Get Out, okay, yeah. and Get Out was like just as good. So I was nervous, but after watching it, yeah, I think it I think it kind of lived up to it. So we have Ma. Yeah. A movie that I did not expect to be too too good, especially after I started seeing the trailers basically give up the ghost about what the movie was about because I loved it when it was like very vague yeah. uh, what role she was playing when it came to everybody else and then like the trailer two three months before it came out it was like yeah here's the connection I'm like why would you do that why would you cut the legs out from under it because I would have loved to go in not knowing this Yeah, but we got this movie Ma it's about a mother and a daughter moving from San Diego to the flyover states, to Ohio, Bumble, their words, Bumblefuck Nowhere. Yeah, yeah. In Wait, Ohio. it was Ohio? It was Ohio. You didn't see the license plates? Shit. No! Yeah, see, I, Holy see, I, shit. you gotta, you gotta pay attention to detail. I had I had my eyes, I was trying to scope, I trying to figure out where they was. did I get Ohio? I, I almost thought it was Illinois at first, but then I like, did too, that's why I'm like, wait, Ohio? Well, yeah, they had Ohio license plates. Oh my God, so, yeah, okay. It's, it's taking place in Ohio, uprooting their lives in the middle of the school year. Uh, Maggie and her mother, uh, Erica, uh, Maggie played by Diana Silvers and Erica by uh, Juliette Lewis. And just going through life as a regular 16-year-old girl trying to make friends in school. And as she makes friends in school with, like, the usual popular kids, you know, who aren't exactly on the up and up. But mm-hmm. you're not, like, bad kids. They're just no, kids. You know, they're no. kids. You know, you're going to drink and smoke I, I thought they were going to annoy the shit out of me. Yeah. They don't annoy me. That is, I actually enjoy... That is the, the best part of this movie. I actually enjoyed the kids. That is the really good thing about this because I was just like you. I was like, okay, are they going to be douchebags? Yeah. Are they going to just be cookie cutters? Like, no, no. They were fun. They were funny. Yeah. They were, like, multidimensional. Uh, they were enjoyable to watch. So, like, when you have the scenes with the kids, uh, and there are a lot of them uh, with the teenagers, uh, when you have the scenes with the kids, you don't hate it. You don't no. want. You don't want to just like okay, get to get to it. Because like, if this was just uh, a drama about kids just trying to find their place, I wouldn't yeah. have hated this movie. I I wouldn't have hated it if it there was no killing. Yeah. It could have worked. It could have still worked. So that was that was very good on their part but because they didn't they didn't try to shoehorn them into no. a horror movie. They built the horror movie around, around them. them. Right. So that made that work. And what also made it work is Octavia played so well with them oh my god okay like it was just good chemistry all the way around that is the nothing perfect felt, word nothing felt chemistry. out of place when they were all on the scene nothing felt out of place yeah nothing felt it was just as you said you were just uncomfortable like this is creepy as shit yeah because she she played the role as like like the cool lady uh even though she's really uncool but she was just like you know i'll, I'll let Do you, you really guys want to say uncool yeah she was uncool she is going to come Ricky, okay, dude. don't first of all don't. 
She do not trick you. Do not. not we ain't we ain't gonna do that. I, I'm not gonna sleep with my door closed and a bat like across my chest. Like you I will swear on you some said people. Uncool. But Octavia Spencer plays Sue Ann, a, a veterinary assistant, uh, who is from the same small town that that she moves to. It virtually everybody. I just, don't think she. I think she lived there her whole life. I yeah, don't that's think what she I'm saying. Moved. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's like she she ain't moved. Nobody. It almost feels like nobody moved aside from Maggie and her mother. Yeah, and they came back. But uh, she plays Sue Ann, uh, who used to go to uh, the same high schools and everything that everybody else. That's that's where the connection is. They were old high school, uh, not friends, classmates. Because friend is not the word I'd use. And uh, she happens upon them, finds out who they are, decides to help them out and get booze and make sure that they, they party. she decide to help them out? Well, she decided to help them out for a reason that I'm not going to say. Okay. Because I don't want to get into fair. that. No, that's fair. But she fair. decides to help them out, brings them to her house, and is like, you know, it's better to, it's better to drink here then where are y'all at? Even though she orchestrates the reasoning behind it, yeah. but it's like it's better to stay within uh, within these confines. But like I was thinking that her descent into craziness was gonna be gradual. That shit was abrupt. Oh yeah. Once she started, she didn't stop. Oh my god! It was like a light switch every freaking time. Yes. It was like a trigger word every single time would make her go from like, "Ha ha, mom, the cool kid." What the fuck you say? I'm like what? Yeah. Where did that come from? Yeah. Like immediately, immediately, yeah. I'm sitting here like looking at my sister going, "What the frick is happening?" Yeah. Like, and yeah. we were like maybe 20, 30 minutes into the movie. Yeah, we were. Speaking, but it started quickly. Speaking of 20, 30 minutes into the movie, my sister got scared. Tell her why you got scared. Oh, my God. Okay, you know what? I have respect for the Force. Got it. I understand what you do. I understand what you're doing, okay? Mm. Especially if you are patrolling the movie theater. Well, I don't think but listen, the jackass. Okay. Listen, jackass. You still can get fucked up. When you are in a movie theater, predominantly full of black folk, black folk, you know how and it's black a scary folk, movie, and you know how black folk are with scary movie, right? <laughs> and everybody was like that for yes. this movie, <laughs> and everybody was already on the edge of their seat. Mm -hmm. Not only that, you decide to do this shit right after a, a jump, jump scare scene, right after, not later right after like adrenaline is still going Did you just say adrenaline yes <laughs> adrenaline is still going blood is pumping in the heart people are just like holy shit seriously, seriously. and then you're going to reach across me to ask the man in front of me to put his cell phone up sir 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 no like, it, oh, sir wait. Sir, oh, excuse yeah. me, sir. You will get fucked up accidentally. I don't care who you are. Accidentally on purpose. Yes. <laughs> because again, sir, consider fight or flight. Okay? Yeah. Fight or flight. I, I can't believe Back to the that. movie review. Back to the review. Because that was unprofessional, but was... I just had to make that known. <laughs> yeah, because like I saw her jump and I'm just like... I, he's in the corner of my eye yeah. at the doorway. He just like and I'm like, why are you hovering Spencer? here, right. bruh? And he walks right behind. I'm thinking like, okay, he's just going to be walking behind. He stops, turns, sir, sir, sir. Right in sir. between us. And I had to jump. I turned around and jumped and was like, I'm like, could dude, you have done that no. better? There's a, there's a whole row of seats in you front of you. You didn't even know what to say. You were shocked. Like, like what the, why shit? would you do that in this movie? No, you thought I was going to mess him up because you were like, oh, shit. Wrong time, bruh. Wrong time. If I didn't know that he was security, that would have really been fucked up. For him, yeah. Yeah. Because I was like, dude, no. Oh, I'm sorry, little lady. I'm sorry. I'm just like, dude, no. You should not have no. done that shit. You should not have done I'm like, that no. Shit. Then goes one, two, three, four seats next to me to get the girl on the same row that we are to tell her. Scares the fuck out of her. So she's bantering <laughs> with him. So all you hear is, could you not? Could you not? Could you not? Well, ma'am, I'm trying to tell you. She was like, well, I, could you not? You telling me about a phone, but you scaring the fuck out of people. I was like, oh, yeah, you shit. you scared and scared some people. So. But, but back to the review. Back to the review. Back to the review. Uh, <sighs> yeah, Octavia Spencer. Uh, never let her be a, a, a villain in another scary movie again because I did not oh, like I'm that. Oh, I'm all for her being a villain. I did not like that. I am all for her being a villain. The story, um, the story 
is primarily just her and the kids interacting and everybody else inside. And Octavia Spencer fucks some people up. She fucks some people up in this movie. She is yeah. not playing around. And you called her uncool. No. Oh, yeah. She she was. You called her uncool. She was. Okay. You know what? I'm not going to get a needle to my neck. She's cool. She's you cool. Called her I'm uncool. not going to get a needle to my neck. You used the word adjective uncool. Mm. 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 She's a kaiju to me. <laughs> She's I mean, a hill kaiju. Sorry. I mean, she is a monster. She's a hill kaiju. The way, the way she made this Octavia work. Octavia Spencer, you she, hear this review? She is a You're monster. a hill kaiju. Hit me up. I got you, girl. Now, despite the fact that, I, as I said, I did like the movie. I did like it. The pacing at some points did get pretty slow. And it kind of pulled you out of it a little bit. But again, it was redeemed mainly by the characters. Man, I, I got a stuffed up nose out of nowhere. I'm starting to sniffle and everything. I don't know where that came from. Uh... <laughs> But, like, the pacing did get a little slow uh, until, like, the killing started ramping up. And when they ramped up again, when, like, when Octavia showed her crazy side, she never stops. No. She never stops. She can't contain that shit. When no. she starts killing people, it never stops. You no. can't contain that shit. And when she, I say she fucks some people up. She's a she dick killing some people. Pe- oh, she, she is a major dick up. killing people. Like, she's like, shit. The only other problem that I had is, uh, and this is not really much of a spoiler because I'm not telling you how things happen or why things happen, but uh, the kids were very redeemable, but like a few of the adults that got it, you're just like not rooting for them to survive because like they they told uh, the reasoning behind her, her weird, uh, I guess psychosis is, is what I probably call uh, it. Yeah, it, it put everything into motion as to why she was doing what she was doing. Like, yeah, like, like, you, like you understand. And, like, I like a killer that I can understand. But at the yeah. same time, I would have really loved it if she was incredibly warped. And none of that ha- actually happened the way that she remembered it. <laughs> yeah. I'm telling myself, I was like, man, if she w- if she was just like, you know, it was like a misunderstanding and yeah. she was mad, that would have been really much more fucked up. And I could understand it. But instead, it was like, dude, when you're going to get it, I'm not going to be here like, oh, man, that's a shame. I'm just going to look back and just be like, mm, you hear something? You hear yeah. something? I ain't going to help you because you really fucked up, bro. Yeah. Uh, a few of the people really fucked up. Um, there's really, there's really not many cons about this. Like, this is, this is a pretty, like, it's, it, it's if, a good standalone it's, movie. It's, it's a good movie. Yeah. It's, it's a good movie. It's, yeah. it's, it's, it's a good movie. I'm yeah, not, some, I'm not, I'm not going to knock agree. it. Some parts did kind of lag a little bit and not annoyingly lag. It just kind of lagged noticeable. a little bit. It, yeah. was, it was when it was noticeable that it was it, just it like, was noticeable, you're kind of padding your time. Yeah. Just but a little bit. to, like you said, to cover their tracks of that, you did have some comedic timing and that kind of made up for the lagging. Because yeah. even when it did lag, it was comedic timing. And yeah, they, 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 well, there's, so there's enough lagging. comedy yeah. in here. There is one scene that John Mugg is going to love. There's one, there is one funny ass. Him. I'm not going to tell him. I'm just okay. saying. There is a funny ass scene you're going to love. But like when we say that it's lagging, this movie is barely a feature length. It's just like an hour and 39 minutes. I wish and it, it was longer. I kind of I kind of did it, too, but I kind of wish it was longer. At the same time, like when it starts lagging and you you take I a look get, at the yeah, time, you're like, yeah. "Man, y'all had a story to tell, but like you didn't tell more of it." Yeah. And you could have, and it almost well, maybe felt like be a sequel. Maybe. Maybe I, I mean so. there's, there's not a lot of sequel bait in this, but like I want to oh, see I more Ma. I want to see more Ma. Yeah, because uh, they 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 did throw like a couple twists in there. Like they they had a character at the beginning that out of nowhere turns out to be kind of crucial at yeah. the end, and like it's, it's fun. It's, yeah, fun. it's fun. fun. It's fun. Like it, this is kickstarting like your summer uh fun popcorn movies it's it's not like incredibly visceral but it doesn't it doesn't insult your intelligence no, the way like say brightburn did like did it, it, have to i had to bring burn. it up because it really tried to insult your fucking intelligence by just being like we're very smart and we're not saying shit like this one is just like hey here's ma she kills people uh she, have fun. she there, there's yeah. a problem with her and you're gonna see what the problem is and she kills people and there you go and like 
that it's exactly what it says on the tin. Yeah, it it delivers what it says yeah. on the tin. Yeah. It's it doesn't leave you hollow. It's fun. Yeah, it's, it's fun. fun. It's 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 not necessarily unnecessarily gory or no, anything. No, it's, it's, it's 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 redeemably gory actually. Like it when it is gore, it makes sense. Yeah, like you got gratuitous violence, there. and this is like tasteless violence. Like yeah. this is this is a Playboy pinup versus like hardcore porn. That's what, that's what this is. What Brightburn was trying to do. Yeah. Yeah, Brightburn was porn. But anyway, let us get to our scores. Daria, help me out here. Tell me, tell me what you got there for the score, little lady. I'm giving it four. Damn. I'm giving it four stars. Just, yeah. Just, just throwing the four out there. I mean, Octavia played her ass off. Yeah, hell yeah, she's getting four stars. Ah, uh, shit. Now I feel like an asshole. Why? I was you have get... your own mind. I know, dude. I know, but I still feel like an asshole. But still, I, I give you just it. A... Don't want that needle. Oh, she's not coming to get me. She's not bothering me. I didn't call her uncool, churlish D. I'm giving it a three. See, unruly. I enjoyed this movie. Uh, it's it's pretty basic. It, it's, it's it's basic. It's but a, it's a it's good a, basic. It's a good basic, yeah. but it's, it's basic. It's a basic movie. Okay. It's one that Three you won't fair. hate. You know, you see it on HBO, you'll want to watch it. You'll see it on... Uh, you I'll even go You won't see it, it on day. cable, because there's a scene in there that you will not see on cable. Uh, there's but quite a few scenes in there. There's a few well, scenes yeah. in there. There's one in particular. You oh, know what I'm one. talking that's about. That's very noticeable that no, it won't be uh, on, uh, but, on cable. It'll be on HBO, but it won't be on like, like USA Network presents the world premiere of Ma. Like, yeah, no, that ain't happening. That is not happening. Yeah, no. But yeah, you know, it's it's a fun movie it, it, it really hits the notes that it needs to yep. uh um as i said it it does kind of lag and it does feel like there is a better story that wasn't told yeah. but but that's like fair. what it tells you in 99 minutes this is pretty that's, fun that's it's pretty, pretty fun and enjoyable the yeah. ending was incredibly satisfying yeah i like that a lot i did too. And it was like an immediate resolution i i'm saying was like it? See, you, you you trying to get to the sequel, baby. I, I, I swear to God. Please call bait. me up. I want a sequel, please. Yes. What's that resolution at the end? I mean, damn. Exactly. Man, shit, because like. Yeah, you, this you, seems you, like some You, you know what they bullshit. tell you if, the, if you don't see a body. That's, yeah, that's, that's, so that's what... if you watch Power, you know at the end of Power, 50 Cent gets on fire. I'm just gonna leave it at that. Wow, wow. Okay, you know what? That's that's because if you favorite. watch Power, you saw that scene, you understand where I'm going. All there I know go. is, all I know is, if 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 Octavia Spencer be suddenly out of nowhere becomes my mom, um, I'm running. I'm not. I'm running. I'm not. I'm, okay, technically we won't be running for a reason, but I'm gonna try to run. I'm a military crawl my ass. I'm gonna be like, what's up, ma? What we doing today? Who are we fucking up? <laughs> Kaiju out. <laughs>